This weekend, the Virginia Symphony will present a special concert in celebration of the beauty of water. This co-production with the Virginia Arts Festival will feature new music, poetry, choral singing, Claude Debussy's La Mer, and presentations by young artists from the community. I asked Virginia Symphony conductor and music director Eric Jacobson how this concert came together. Well, I, I think the, the main thing was we wanted to celebrate the community and the fact that we are surrounded and in the midst of water. And of course, as musicians, we can celebrate that in so many different ways, including getting to work with our some of our dear artist friends more in the literary world, poets and writers. So it felt like this was a, a really special way to sort of close the season and celebrate our community is, is the main thing. And you're incorporating some young folks into the concert. Yeah, yes, actually. So we've had a, a really fun couple of months working this out. So um, we more or less put a call out to, um, to school districts saying, who wants to be a part of this? Who wants to write some poems that we will then set to music and perform on this concert? So we've had so many incredibly beautiful and, and brilliant poems come to us from, from local students. And so what we've done is we've chosen a few of them. Unfortunately, we couldn't do every one. We've chosen a few of them to sort of almost give us a, a, a text into some of the orchestral works that we'll be doing. And we'll have those, those poems read and performed by the Hurrah Players, which is this incredible group of, of uh, young artists and uh, stage performers. And we really look forward to that. And in addition to the, uh, the spoken word and the orchestra, you've got the chorus involved, too. The chorus is with us singing two incredible pieces. Uh, we have Copeland's At the River, which is about the most beautiful short song you could imagine. And, and the reason we thought that piece should be included is, you know, when you really think about it, um, humanity ends up near water, whether it's the ocean or the river or a lake or something, because we need it. It's our lifeline for mm. so many reasons. Um, and the idea of gathering, the idea of, hey, this is where we're establishing our, our community. And also this is where we celebrate. This is where we celebrate beautiful happenings in our lives. It also is the place that we, we mourn near water. And it, it's a, a, a beautiful way we're ending with that piece. We also have a piece by Gabriel Kahane, who wrote a piece just for this project, and it's actually a little bit humorous. That was sort of the, the um, initiation. It was, uh, can you write something about water that has a joke? And he came up with a, a great piece called LaCroix. Of course, um, we spend lots of our time drinking bottled water and canned <laughs> water, and it's delicious. And I think this piece will um, deliver. I should I should also say... Uh, that not only do we have the poetry of students in the area, we also have a performance by the incredible group Teens with a Purpose, performing an original piece of theirs. And, of course, the, the poet laureate of Virginia, Louisa Gloria, who's performing a work of her own called Foolish, which is great. World premieres, really. World premieres. The, the, the Gabriel Kahane is a world premiere and a poet and artist composer in the community, also named Jerome Ellis, wrote a piece that, that he will both perform with us and the orchestra. He wrote the text and the, the entire um, score for it. I, I just can't wait to be together and, uh, and dig into this. All right. We're talking about a very special concert coming up from the Virginia Symphony in coordination with the Virginia Arts Festival, with Eric Jacobson conducting, of course. And it is going to be a, a real uh, community effort on the part of uh, the orchestra, the chorus, the readers, the young folks involved. And uh, you mentioned the orchestral music, Eric. Uh, Dolph Hailstork will kick things off with one of his pieces. One of his great works, I mean, of course, he has so many incredible works, but uh, Dolph, of course, uh, is, is, a, is a member of our community in, in Virginia Beach, and he wrote this piece called An American Port of Call, and it felt like the perfect piece to kick off. Not only is it just a heroic opening to any concert, but of course, it's a, it's a port, it's a port piece, and it's, uh, it's based on our port, and, you know, the idea 
of a composer who is celebrated around the world living with us, living in our community, and a piece that actually the Virginia Symphony recorded a handful of years ago, bringing it back on this concert feels like a perfect jumping off point. Virginia Symphony conductor Eric Jacobson speaking about this weekend's symphonic celebration of water. This concert will be presented Saturday, June 4th at 7.30 p.m. at Chrysler Hall in Norfolk. For ticket information, go to virginiasymphony.org or to vafest.org.